Greetings and salutations YouTube, it's Hayden here. Welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be going to one of my favorite stores that I haven't been to in forever, St. Vincent de Paul. Right there, it's the largest thrift store here in Southern California. It's huge. I actually forgot how many square feet this place is, but it's insane. They actually sell cars here, which is pretty cool. Look at it. You can buy that BMW right there if you want. Let's actually see the price. I'm wondering how much this car costs. And this car cost it's on sale for $800. Wow, amazing. We got some outdoor furniture or furniture outside. Not not outdoor furniture. I guess some of them we could put outside. But and also there are the colors of the day, blue 25% off, yellow 50, and all green 120. So let's go into the store and check it out. I haven't been here again in a hot second, so I'm really excited to see what they have. Shoes. Oh, the chandelier. Whoa. We got some wallets in here today. I wonder what handbags we have. Anything good? You guys, check out how cool this vintage trunk is. Oh my gosh, it's awesome. Let's see what other goodies they have here today. They have a ton of furniture. These are all new furniture pieces that they have here. Looking at the artwork, glassware. Ooh, this is nice. I've seen that somewhere else before too, at a Goodwill, I think. Whoa, look at the legs on that table. These are some pretty nice outdoor tables too. This one's $100, so it's on sale. All miscellaneous items, 25% off. All right, you guys, I'm looking at the handbags that they have on this little fixture right here. See what they have. A lot of these are brand new. Montserrat de Luca. I think they sell these at, um, these are like anthropology bags. This is actually really cute. I think that says it's $10. How cute, like what a fun summer bag, right? Here's another one in pink. Also Montserrat de Luca. Oh, look at that. <laughs> we also have it in black. And another one in cream. I just found a Mark by Marc Jacobs like sunglass case. It's like a little dusty, but $1.50. It's actually a really cute case. I actually like, I'm like, I like smaller sunglass cases, like something like this. But I want one that's a little more, I do have one already, but I kind of want to see if I can find another one. Ooh, I do like these triangular ones. Okay, check it out, you guys. I also found um, this other, what is this? I think this is another Monserrat de Luca. I forgot where the tag went. Oh, here it is. Another Monserrat de Luca bag. This one's in like a soft Yano style. It's a little bit dirty, but I think I can clean that. And then found this little Kipling over there as well. Let's see if we can find any other cool bags. This is like a cool suede. This is a Remy and Reed. Hey you guys, I found the bag online. They're $85 each. And these are about, I think they're $10 each. So, it's a pretty good deal. Just found a fake Tory. <laughs> this place is huge. Like, I don't know, like I don't even think it comes off on camera how large this place is. But this place is massive. This is only the, like the part of the clothing section. Um, it, it just goes on. It's so huge. It's so 
much space here. There's so much to look at. You can literally come in here and thrift for the whole day. Found another stand with bags on it. Found this fossil. I think it's $8.99. It has a bunch of prices written on it that got um, like scratched off. They have so many of these Monserrat de Luca bags. All right, you guys, so I am in the other side of the store now. Um, they sell all sorts of stuff. They have washers, dryers, stoves, ovens. Uh, I wanted to look at the furniture, because sometimes they have some cool furniture pieces here. And I'm interested to see what they have to offer. They have a bunch of hutches. The last time I was here was like around the holidays and it was severely depleted in terms of um, stuff that they had here. And I feel like they have a lot more now. Ooh, look at that bench. Let's go look at it. This is honestly kind of cute, but it's 60 bucks. Oh, it's really rickety, okay. Maybe no to that. Let's see what else we can find. This is actually where I got, if you guys remember, my two outdoor tables, the blue tiled ones that are West Elm. I actually got them here. They were super cheap. Check out this chair. It's actually pretty nice. <laughs> I actually also really like this one for some reason. I don't know if it's a combination out of the print and the style. It looks like a shell. Kind of cool. We're on the other side of the store. This is like the used, um, like bedroom furniture, dress, uh, dresser. No, no, not dress. Yeah, some dressers, side tables, desks, smaller tables. Look at this bunk bed. It's actually pretty nice. I think actually some of these beds are also brand new as well. Check that out. Then we're gonna make our way. Over here, this is where they used to have all the seasonal stuff, and now I think just has like kind of like the more random stuff. They have bikes and still seasonal stuff, candles, two four dollar face wipes, frozen stuff. I actually own a bowl from this collection. <laughs> this whole collection is fifty dollars for the fifteen piece set. So check it out. I found um, these right here. So I guess that they're two pieces and then two pieces. And these are from Restoration Hardware. Candlestick holders. Hey guys, just got everything inside the car. It was so much fun hanging out with you guys today. And I hope you guys had fun checking out the store. We haven't been here in a hot second. But if you guys enjoyed this video and would like me to go back again, um, hit the like button. Let me know down below in the comments if this uh, if this is a store you guys enjoy. And don't forget to tune in tomorrow for the haul video. And I love you guys so much. See you guys later. Bye. Alright, sorry. There are carts walking or coming by. But there's this lamb clutch right here. This is pretty cute. This is a coach. How cool. Made in New York. This is rare. I've never seen one made in New York like in real life before. That's really awesome. I'm better. All that I remember is tiny tragedies. Sorry you guys, I'm just like totally into this song right now, it's bringing me back to the 2000s.